Thank you for the opportunity to present this article titled MRI Screening After Silicone Implant Breast Surgery, Patient Survey of Adherence to FDA Recommendations. I know you all will enjoy this article that reviews MRI screening after silicone breast implant surgery and also highlights recent updates to FDA recommendations and areas for future research. Previously, the FDA recommended that all women with silicone breast implants undergo routine screening with repeated MRIs to detect implant rupture beginning three years after implant surgery and then every two years thereafter. However, long-term screening and repeated MRIs are both inconvenient and costly, both for patients and insurance providers. And in this article, the authors found that only 5.9% of women with silicone breast implants received MRIs after their surgery in accordance with those FDA guidelines. Possible reasons for this low adherence include variation in insurance coverage policies for MRIs, as well as differences between former FDA guidelines and recommendations from the American College of Radiology. In March of 2019, the General and Plastic Surgery Devices Advisory Committee convened to update former FDA recommendations. New guidelines state that MRIs may begin five to six years after implant surgery and then every two to three years thereafter. These guidelines also suggest that ultrasound may be a more appropriate initial screening tool for patients without symptoms and that MRIs could potentially be reserved for symptomatic patients or patients with an equivocal ultrasound finding. Given the increased accessibility and lower cost of ultrasound, it's possible that these updated guidelines may improve patient and provider adherence to following surveillance recommendations. However, future research is needed to understand the impact of these updated guidelines on adherence to surveillance, identify barriers to implementation of these new guidelines, and also determine whether these guidelines are valid. Thank you very much. Thank you.